I think she's 47 here. And welcome back, all you lovely people. Oof. Yeah. I kind of like it at night because everyone's in the mage's quarters, which gives me plenty of time to track everyone down. Oh, Theo. Hello there. Is there something I can do for you? Why, yes. Yes, there is. Revenant, you say? And it represents something in the heavens? It sounds familiar. Let me think. Let me ah, think. Yes, now I remember. Yeah. Valkar was here some time ago asking about just such a thing. That was for so research. research. He had a large sheaf of notes with him about it. I'm afraid I didn't have any more advice for him than I do for you. With the Ori in such a state of disrepair, I have no point of reference. Falcor did leave this behind. I think it fell from his notes as he left. Mm -hmm. much attention, but perhaps it will be of use to you. Hastily scrawled note. I've heard things to be sh Is it true that some of our guildmates were killed? Yeah. Farewell. Yes, it was. Because they have grown soft. Oh no, wait, this is magic. I don't wanna I don't need any of that. I want the that's it. The Dark Fissure, Fort Isterius, Fort Lynchel, Windelbeck. Anchorite will have been called. Watch the skies once a week, his grace shines down on us. Yeah. So in this game, with Grand Soul Gems, if you find one of these altars, you can on a certain day of the week, and I forget which day it is, but you can put the Grand Soul Gems into the altar. And I want to say you cast some kind of spell on it, like Fortify Magicka or whatever, and they become Black Soul Gems. It's very neat. Hey, buddy. Well met. Well met. So, Falcar expressed interest in this revenue mm -hmm. and left this this lists several locations. The first is the Dark Fisher. Yeah. If there is indeed an altar there, as the note suggests, I believe this cave is directly related to the contents of the book. Go to the Dark Fisher the next time this shade occurs. Search for any connection to what we've learned and report back. Please, be careful. Anything, Anything you find, find. no use to us if you do not survive. Yeah. Do not put yourself in harm. Okay. Yeah, I mean that's fine. Makes sense to me. Be careful. Meow, 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 meow. Now where is this location, though? South of Shaden Hall. There, okay. Good. Good, good, good. I think the first thing I need to do, though, I want to go rest. And the closest place I know to do that is my house in the Imperial Cité. Quick little jaunt over there. Get a rest, level up. Ah. And then we'll find this cave. Are oh, those people? Oh, there's deer. Deers. Look at all the deers. Jump on the water. I really like the water walking spell. It makes for uh, good times, and you can get a champ. You can get enchanted items with it once you learn the spell, which I believe I actually have. Yeah. Here it is. Oh, see you tomorrow. The total's in there, by 
way. Okay. <clears throat> Yay! Cool. I wish you could spend all three points on luck. But I can't. So I won't. We'll just go up one by one. I'll probably be able to get it to around 85 before I run out of... levels to gain which oh actually now that I think about that there are ways to lose skill points in things I know one of those is to go to jail you know do some crime go to jail serve the time when you wake up you've lost some points and things but the trouble is that it's random it's not always a major skill. And while that is all well and good, I just, you don't really need to be any anything higher level than about 50 or so. Because by then you're already pretty pretty broken. Is that Shadowmir? No. It's my training horse. Bad horse, bad horse, bad horse, he's bad. Swampy cave. No. <laughs> Stampy cat. That's funny. He does Minecraft videos a lot. I haven't actually watched a lot of his stuff. I've, I've seen him in... Uh, where did I see him? I think he... He does... He's in one of the videos with... Uh, Rosanna Pansino. For nerdy nummies, who's so ridiculously hot. Well, that's not helpful at all. How am I supposed to get over there? You, you gonna you gonna let me run up this grassy land? Yes. There we go. There we go. Dark Fisher. Oh, hi. I am not sure. Let's go ahead and go in. Kill all the O's in here. And then uh, there's probably notation somewhere that I'll be able to use. And fire uh, in the sky. No, no. Why won't you die? That's an excellent question, my dear. And one that I cannot answer. Ooh. Nice. What is that? So, so that's just on like a regular... The first necromancer you see has the right note? What kind of funky bull shrimp is that? No, no. Thing is, too, like, the way that they're summoning undead and stuff, I can do that myself. Like, that's just conjuration. That isn't, nec that isn't necessarily necromancy. The Black Soul Gem thing's pretty janky. Stop it. Ooh, lightning storm. That sounds fun. All right.
There we go. Sehr gut. Shit. Man, this perception is ridiculous, man. Ain't nobody got time for you and your stupid, stupid stuff. Fragility. Oh, that must be what, what drains the strength. That makes sense. We are going to shoot the mage. The lich. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. My bow, my bow is pretty rad. Is that a trap? Let's not walk over that. That'd probably be probably be best. Ooh, very nice. Large Magicka Drain? Yes, yes indeed. Agronian account. I have these super awesome books that I'll, I might showcase on, on YouTube or whatever, but, uh, it's like the, the Skyrim, they take all the books from the Elder Scrolls and put them all into a single book. Which I think is super neat. I like it very much. I haven't actually read it in, in any kind of entirety. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's very cool. Very cool. Come on, just, just open the damn thing. There we go. Yep. I just, this is one of the bouncy chains. <laughs> it is. I love it. What is that line of life? It's weird. Oh shit, there's stairs down. How did I miss that? Gotcha. What the hell? Ooh, dwarven arrows. Always use those. Alright. Yep. I really like the necromancer fog stuff. It makes a nice creepy effect. Ooh. And any <laughs> anytime you see that fog in the game, you'll know that there's going to be undead somewhere in this area. Which turned out to be true. As it's rank with necromancers. Whee! As an interesting side note, <coughs> I've noticed that you, there's not really any way for you to describe, describe, uh, there's not really any way for you to say, be wearing necromancer robes and become, shit, uh, like blend in with them. You know, they see you. You're different. You're not one of their known necromancer buddies, I guess. And they immediately attack. Like, there's not even any inquiry into, oh, well, he might be from a different necromancer clan. 
or something like that. You cannot disguise your that's the word, disguise yourself as anything. You're just you. Sometimes that works out, sometimes it doesn't. We're gonna go chat with Raminus Paulus again, and then we'll end the video. So we're just about out of time again. Hello. Hey buddy. Have you been to the dark fissure yet? I have, yeah. Let's talk about that here. Where is that necromancers? So you saw then. The altars must be infused with some kind of power to change over the soul gems. Mm -hmm. I shall pass the news on to the council. Most troubling indeed to know that these are not merely myths. I also fear their numbers may be greater than we believed. I've killed a bunch of necromancers. That's that's a fair statement right there. You have my thanks and that of the council as well. All right. You our conjurer no I am now magician tasks. Seek out Archmage Travin. He has personally requested that you see him for your next assignment. Okay. Be seen. That's a good that's a good sign. We can finally go in here without problems. Han Hannibal Travin. Greetings. It is high time that we met. Raminus has told me good things about you. Yeah. You have advanced quickly and show great promise. I now intend to put your talents to a more direct test. Okay. Tests. Are you prepared? Yes. Very good. The Council of Mages has been aware of the ink uh -huh. has been our position to sit back and watch what unfolded. But that most of our information on the necromancers has come from an informant inside the cult itself. Got it. There's someone on the inside? Yes. And we have for quite some time. Though the info the council was initially reluctant to believe the information was mm -hmm. clear that our informant is in danger. Who's the informant? Lucianus Elias. He is not a council member, but has long aware of the growing interest in the guild after the ban on necromancy was put into place. Okay. With my blessing, he infiltrated the group and has I have not heard from Go on. The lack of reports from Lucianus has disturbed the council. A yep. group of battle men I argue where do we need to go? Lucianus last reported being sent to the ruins of Nenyon, Nenyon Twill. South, okay. south of the White Rose River. Nearly halfway. I'm afraid I know nothing more about the location. I fear the battle. We have to go find him Lucianus. and save him. To, please hurry. Yeah. yeah. Go now. Got it. Very well. Thank you. I shall open. Cool. Make haste. Lucianus is in All right. danger. We are out of time. A little, little bit past time, actually, but. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. Appreciate that. Bumblebee Tuna. Ugh. And we'll see you next video.